I saw one of your comments on um, a video that we uploaded from Sarah Garvey. <laughs> <laughs> No need to body shame, although the show was trash. <coughs> Talking about UK Baddest show, right? All right, so what's his name? Uh, Sarah Garvey. All right, so we're going to address two things. Mm -hmm. We're going to address him. We're going to address the show. So, um, look, I checked his page. And you have to be really in this social media game for a while to know what a clickbait is. I've gone on his page. Yo, he, he bashes women all the time. Listen, it's normal. This is light work for him. This is, he's, he's got an issue. Like if, he, if he saw me, I'm fat to him. Trust me. I'm, I'm a fat babe to him. I'm masculine. You understand? Like I've seen his page. So, so sometimes you've got to educate yourself and not be rattled by the norm because this is what he normally posts on his um, page. Mm. So this is nothing new. You can say what you want about him. You can comment what you want about him, but this is what he, he posts. However, looking at him on a visual aspect i just think to make such remarks and to look like a malteser that's melting you can giggle baby <laughs> <laughs> you can laugh <laughs> but my thing is is that like he looks like a he looked like a melted malteser you know when you just had a packet of chocolate out in the sun for a bit too long and you try to take it out and it's all sliding down your hands and you, you try to eat and you go, well, lick it off. You think that's what he looks like, except he's not lickable. So my thing is, is that, listen, one thing I've learned about this social media thing, yeah, you can get caught slipping. I'm seeing in the comments that he's done kiss the man for money. You understand? This is what happens when you, I'm telling you from experience. Mm. When you go viral, get ready for all the smoke. So I hope he understands where I'm coming from. You said something crazy, in my opinion. And I'm just letting you know that you are not even above the basic, let alone the average, to even be calling anyone out of their names, you understand? And if your preference is not these women, that's absolutely fine. You've got 19-year-olds on here, you've got 21-year-olds on here, you look old enough to be their father, you understand? So just be mindful how you're speaking about women. Mm. But at the same time, when he touched on the show itself... Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. A1, he nailed it. Oh, you agree with that part? Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I just, I'm just talking about the, the, the cussing part. The cussing part was unnecessary. Yeah. If you want to talk about the concept, talk about the concept. If you want to say that the director is stupid, she's this, she's that, go for it. What, what are your thoughts on the show? <laughs> is it out yet? I haven't even seen it. I don't know if it's out, but I know there's a lot of things that have been leaked. Yeah, yeah. It's a mess. Mm -hmm. It's a mess. All right. I why, mean, why I know some of the people on there. Yeah. It's a mess. Well, as in like it's the way best. that it was organised? It's I think that part definitely, the organising part. But like I said, I'm only going by people's lives and posts. You know, yeah. no one's watched any episode. No one has done a review on the episode. But I also know Lani. Yeah. On a personal level. And Are I know you guys friends? Or? At one point. All oh, right, right. So I know when she wants to get something done. So is there beef or is it cool? <laughs> <laughs> Why did you go? Like, <laughs> like two super wrestlers. You sound like my man, you know. You got a problem with my size, babes. No, I don't. <laughs> you know what that I'm means, isn't it? Like, no, no, no. Like knuckles, yeah, it's, no, no. It's not. It's not. It's not beef. We were genuinely good friends, so yeah, yeah. it's hundred percent appalling. Out. I wouldn't call it beef, even though I know she made some comments about me joining the show. It was sent to me, but I could just kind of let it oh, slide. Yeah, yeah, okay. Like. I would have never gone on that show for so many reasons. And if I was her friend, that casting would have been sweet. Out. <laughs> there was too much going on. You got 19 year olds with 34 year olds. All right. And there's just a certain level of bullying I was seeing. I'm seeing someone's whole braid got pulled out. Wow. I'm seeing Lani getting kicked with the, the director, getting hit with a frying pan. Damn. I just, I'm just thinking to myself, would this have happened if I was still her friend? Or am I bugging? Because there's no way my friend getting lick off with a frying pan is impossicant. There was just too much going on. Um, but like I said, the main thing is that I don't think he needed to call these girls out of, out of their name just because they want to do a trash show. The show was trash. We mm. get it. And that's just what I've got to say on the show. Would I have done it? Not in a million. No. I don't fight for camera. All right, I see. You know what I mean? I think what they were doing was very wild. You're in a different country. 
What what is the concept of the show? It's like a reality show. For your... So there's another show in America called um, Baddies. Okay, yeah, yeah. And they go to like different cities in America, and they've got Baddie East, Baddie West. I don't know if they've got Baddie South. And the producer, um, the co-producer Natalie Nunn, and another guy named Lamel on the wall, they they come up with the concept, and you know it's been working for them. They've made money. Like you got women swinging left, right, and centre. They even step to the side to allow women to fight. But, you oh. know, you're in a different country, in a different culture that condones and accepts that behaviour. Yeah. They don't even care about getting arrested. they got bail money. You understand? That, that is the country that you're in. And it's a much bigger country. Mm -hmm. So the kind of beef that some of these girls are in, I promise you, are, they're not going to see each other. Some of them live on the other side of America. You understand what I'm trying to say to you? Yeah. London is small. Yeah. The kind of beef that was created on that show... With young girls, as, as, as remember, I worked with, not only have I worked with children, but I've worked with the youth, you understand? Mm. I've worked with 18 year olds, 19 year olds, 17 year olds, 13 year olds. I'm seeing 19 year old girls on there, you know. Apparently, sex workers, you know. Oh, young wow. girls. And this is what we're promoting for them. This is what we're doing for them. So, this is what I have to say on the show, you understand? Like, I think women fight, I get it. People want to see the drama, but then to egg on and, um, instigate things and put people in rooms that you know there's going to be severe problems i think that's wild you understand i heard yeah. lani got arrested in croatia due to damages and all this kind of headache yeah wow. what do you think this is this isn't america han mm -hmm. you didn't even do it in the uk you went the whole croatia them man don't speak our, our language how are you going to explain to them all of this mm. you understand so that's my opinion on the show i'm not hating in it i'm just i'm a, i'm a viewer like everyone else me and her are not friends so just see me as a viewer. Yeah, yeah, I yeah. Yeah, not not a big. I heard there was two security guards for like was it nineteen girls <laughs> or something like that. We're not going to talk about the security. You know why? Because some of the people that were working behind the scene are actually cool with them, innit? Like some yeah. of them oh, are right, like right, right. some of them um, part of production. They, I'm actually generally cool with them. So I'm not going to get onto them. I don't really know how they did things. I don't know the back scenes on that one. I can only speak on the cast. Some of the people that I know, some of the people that I still follow, Lani, um, and the dickhead that called them out of their names. Sorry. Did I call him out of his name? Oh no. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry, Malteser. That was rude. That was rude. Sorry.